Hi, I'm Dr. Pramada from Relief Medical Group and Fremont Chiropractic Group, and we get asked a lot of questions about a procedure that we do that's called extracorporeal shockwave treatment or acoustic compression. So we just wanted to post some videos to answer the, the questions so that we can forward people to these videos and they can get their answers at their own pace and their own convenience. Uh, essentially, uh, extracorporeal shockwave treatment or this acoustic compression is a treatment that does two things. First of all, it helps to release adhesions or scarring that takes place in some chronic conditions. And secondly, it tends to bring blood supply to an area. So it's not a procedure that's used as a pain relief procedure like a medication or an injection or perhaps laser therapy. It's actually something that goes in and corrects the underlying condition. This is what we like about it. The evidence shows that it's extremely effective. Uh, essentially what it will do when you take a condition that isn't healing, it, you know, you go through the normal procedures and it isn't healing and it becomes chronic, very often it's because it becomes adhesed and scarred from a lot of inflammation, especially recurrent inflammation, and then as the scarring constricts, it stops the blood supply. So this uh, shockwave is used for conditions such as lateral epicondylitis or tennis elbow, medial epicondylitis or golfer's elbow, rotator cuff tendonitis, tendinopathies, partial tears, which just means the tendons are damaged in there and we wanna go in and if there's calcium, help break up the calcium with these sound waves and also stimulate blood supply so that these small tears can heal. It's extremely effective, it's an in-office procedure, it's relatively inexpensive, and generally takes between five and seven in-office sessions for the treatment. Then over time, the tissues will heal, and generally within a few months, most conditions do very, very well. Again, most commonly it's used for shoulder tendinopathies, elbow problems, problems with the knees or other tendons, such as Achilles tendinopathy down you know, by the ankle uh, and, and tendons of the knees where conservative management has not helped and people start considering things like cortisone injections uh, or surgeries, the shockwave treatments are extremely effective and should be tried first.